Hi, it's Wayne here from Whiskey Alpha, and today we're off to the airfield. How many times do I ever say that? The good news is we're off to the airfield with Wifey. I'm going flying. And yes, we are going flying with Wifey today. So this is going to be a flight to Cywell from Elstree. Never been to Cywell before, so a little bit of an experiment for me. In our plane. In our plane, in uh, Delta Charlie Kilo Kilo and let's see how we get on. I've got a safety pilot with me because it's one of those still getting used to Delta Charlie Kilo Kilo and uh, let's go and have some fun. So, see you later, bye. Clear prop. Yeah, yeah. If you while you're doing it. Two, two, two. I, I can hear you. Um, by the way, what was Cranfield? Now oh, we can pull it off the thing. I'll get, get the old fashioned chart out, shall I? That'd be a good idea. Look at the key. Instruments are set, radios are set, altimeter is set. Fuel, we're on them both. Good morning, Elster Information. Golf Delta Charlie Kilo Kilo request every information and taxi for departure. Kilo Kilo, good morning. Uh, taxi via the apron and Bravo to the hold for runway 26. The noise of aim and departure, the QNH 1026. Brakes off. Brakes working. They are quite sexy, aren't they? They are quite groovy. I do think, yeah, you can put all your little... ...speed and all that on there. Get it projected. Alright, if you can keep an eye out on that side for me. Okay. Which eye would you like me to keep out? Both of them, preferably, because you have binocular vision. <laughs> do with something hanging down from the wingtips so you can actually see where they are. See where they are, yeah. They're much lighter than the PA-28. <laughs> <laughs> and the car you know the carpets aren't moving on this one. Aren't they? No. The are nice and light as well, aren't they? <laughs> yeah. I was complaining about the carpet. He was getting all his excuses in nice and early about why it wasn't going to be good. Why it wasn't being a good flight. <laughs> like the carpets were moving, rudder was heavy, wing was on the bottom, not on the top. Okay, power checks. It's wind. Parking brake is on. Fuel is on. Both. Oil pressure is fine. Temperature is still low, but information. Golf Delta Charlie Kilo Kilo holding a Bravo ready for departure. Golf Kilo Kilo, runway 26, take off your discretion. The wind to is uh, very light, variable. Taking off Golf Kilo Kilo. Our sails onto the centre line. Speed is active. That was smooth. This is weird because I haven't got a wing in the way. I oh, know, it's lovely, isn't it? I know, it's brilliant. It's beautiful. I'm so used to having a wing in the way, it's like, wow! <laughs> yep. We're clear. But that was a lot smoother than I expected. You're radioing or am I radioing? Um, you can radio actually. I'll write everything down. <laughs> oh, and Kilo Kilo's going to Luton on 129.550. Kilo Kilo, Roger, bye bye. Golf Kilo Kilo, party details. Golf Kilo Kilo is a Cessna 172, L Street to Cywell, just to the south of St Albans, 2000 feet, 1026. Uh, requesting basic service and zone transit uh, south to north, please, by the uh, junction of the M1. Golf Kilo Kilo, Roger, Scorp 4673, Luton QNH is 1026. Scorp 4673, 1026. Golf Kilo Kilo identified just to the north of St Albans, it's a basic service. Basic service, Golf Kilo Kilo. Golf Delta Charlie Kilo Kilo, transit the Luton control zone via far north above altitude 2,000 feet, due to the east of the 2-5 threshold. It's clear to uh, zone transit south to north, two to not above 2,000 feet and east of the 2-5 threshold, Golf Kilo Kilo. I just love the way she trims. Yeah. Golf Kilo Kilo entering the Luton zone, radar control. Radar control, Kilo Kilo. Oh, look, all done there, and then it's all golf. 
What a boring way to spend Good Friday. Exactly. exactly. You would need a proper hobby. Yeah. Buy an aeroplane. And it's probably <laughs> just as expensive as well by the time you get cool yeah. fees and all the equipment. Yeah, but this is more interesting. Oh, God, yeah. I'd start singing, mate. Oh, well, that was me. <laughs> I'll let you off the jack. Six miles, descent to altitude 3,000 feet. That's me, I... Is that 3,000 feet? Is it 3 or a minute? Does that cover his fear? <laughs> there is Newton Airport. Newton Airport! Who oh. are you? Not very busy at all. I thought it would be packed, because it's supposedly the great bank yeah. holiday getaway. Yeah, they seem to all be stanced in Manchester, getting it all. I think push it back at all, is it? Nothing on approach. Wow. That's unusual. The landing feet down there. Here's a 63 Romeo Lost of Thermite heading 225, clear down let's approach runway 25. Right heading 225, clear down let's approach runway 25, you think pretty wrong in it. Easy 63 Romeo Delta, Roger. You might see traffic on TCAS about a mile and a half to the north of the airfield. It's clear far continuing northbound. It's a bit hazy. Yeah, it does that from time to time. What's that? A bit hazy. Yeah, there's no wind, you see, so it just... Nothing's moving. ...just sits, yeah. Over there in the distance is Cardington with the... Yep. Uh, big hangers. Hangers. Cranfield, good morning, Golf Delta Charlie Kilo Kilo. Golf Delta Charlie Kilo Kilo, Cranfield, good morning. Much better. Uh, Golf Kilo Kilos, uh, Cessna 172, 3 POB VFR, L Street to Sywell. We've just got 10 miles to run, uh, just to the north of your redfield, but we'll be intercepting your ILS approach. Just wondering if there's any traffic known to conflict. Golf Kilo, Kilo, Roger, Kilo H1026, nothing on the instrument approach at this time. Are you looking to a transit by the Charlie Indy Tango on track, Sawa? Uh, a firm at 1026, Golf Kilo, Kilo. Golf Kilo, Kilo, Roger. Caution, Cardington Danger Area 206 is active. Blimps are airborne today as well. I understand. Uh, there is one airborne at this time. Uh, you can pull across the two on final approach time, basic center. And copy that, and we have one actually airborne at the moment, it looks very nice. And we'll report crossing your uh, Charlie India Tango Golf Kilo Kilo. Okay, right, Charlie and Alfred, but not my last. Uh, da da da. Where's the in flight snacks then? But do we know what runway they're using today? Uh, no, because it was um, find out on traffic. Uh, great. I would say it's going to be 2-1 right. Oh, my little plan. Oh, that's um, Santa Pod Raceway. Oh, okay. Eh? Uh -huh. I've not seen Santa Pod before. Quite well, good morning, Golf for Delta Charlie Kilo Kilo, inbound from the south east uh, from Elk Street. Um, any idea on the runway, please? South of the Golf Mike Charlie, you can leave us overhead uh, set, set side for 2 1 right. Uh, station call in Sywell, we are using 2-1 at the moment, your discretion, Sywell circuit is active. Uh, many thanks, 2-1 uh, right, and we'll report downwind, keeping an eye out for traffic, or kilo kilo. Kilo. I suggest that's it in front of me. Uh, yep. So I'm going to go across yep. the ground. Uh, lose some altitude. He's on. Spitfire race race, just saw the seat down, we're still official with a landing traffic. Spitfire up here. Over there. Wow! Spitfire race race, I uh, right face for 2-1, right, not below 500 feet, first flight through. Kilo, kilo, he's late down, went for 2-1, right, contact with Spitfire. Double jump, it's Chipmunk Golf, up and over the Fox Draft, is uh, 1300 feet, 1026.
Solar traffic, Golf Charlie, Lieber Lima Alpha, Sky Ranger, Micro Light at Fly Light, taxiing to Bravo 2 for departure 21 right. to a 28. <laughs> I thought I was set up in the air. So you're turning final 2-1 right with the gear. Because I think Spitfire wants to come in and land. 